Dave Hodge, where are you? There you go. Zim2 Capital. What a great looking crowd. Isn't it nice? Uh, uh, I'm certainly glad to be speaking here in Vancouver. You can, usually when I, I speak to larger groups, uh, it's in uh, it's it's in some other uh, some other uh, city, some other country, uh, maybe some other continent. It's certainly nice uh, to be speaking to a to a hometown crowd, um, and uh, and a very important crowd that is. I'm here to talk to you about Zimto Capital Corp, but there are a couple of comments that I would like to make about the graphite sector, about what has happened so far today. First of all, Chris Berry told us that, that there was going to be increasing demand for, for graphite, that there was going to be a shortage of supply in the graphite world. The key is when the world starts to run out of a commodity, they come to Vancouver. Vancouver is the capital of exploration money globally. The fact that there's going to be a graphite shortage means that the people in this room are expected to solve that problem. They're expected to find the new deposits. They're expected to finance those new deposits. And that's not only you people, but all of you. And certainly uh, working together, we'll have a very, very exciting graphite future. As you see on, on, uh, on my first slide, our, uh, our normal statement is uh, connecting opportunity and you. And uh, we've changed that to connecting graphite and you for this conference today. The things that I'm going to tell you about Zim2 Capital Corp really all relate back, relate back to the capital structure. And the only number you really need to notice on this page is that there's only 10 million shares out. And that's an important number as you analyze um, the value of what Zim2 should be trading at. The other important aspect, of course, is, is the team of people. And certainly whenever Zim2 looks at an opportunity, an exploration opportunity, at an exploration company, one of the most important things we look at is the people that are behind it. We have a very strong team. I've been in the business for a long time. That's why I look so young and thin. And if anybody needs to argue about that, they can deal with one of my, uh, one of my partners is out in the back alley and he'll talk to you about my size. I do, uh, I do have a director in, uh, in Europe by the name of Sven Olsen. And he not only looks after Zim2 Capital Corp, but many of the holdings that, that Zim2 has in its portfolio. Good friend of mine, Pat Power, not that active with Zim2, but certainly always there to help with, with whatever needs helping. Our sort of our graphite, uh, our, our graphite specialist, um, a, uh, a director of Zim2 Capital, uh, somebody I have lots of respect for, uh, um, Ryan Fletcher, and, uh, and everybody knows and loves uh, Sean Charlin. What I do want to tell you is that, is that basically Zim2 is listed as an investment issuer on the TSX Venture Exchange, and when we first listed as an investment issuer, and I put my friend Pat Power on the board, he said, well Dave, what does that mean? What can we do as an investment issuer? I said, basically, Pat, we can do whatever we want. And that's kind of the key to Zim2 Capital Corp because essentially we are opportunists. And, and we focus those opportunities on early stage, early stage opportunities. We're there we're staking the ground, we're there with the companies before the IPO. Um, we're very involved in the early stage. In terms of um, of our property or our transactional business. We have a number of geological pro uh, partners, either geological firms or prospectors, 
and we have a, a pair here in British Columbia, another prospector here in British Columbia, um, a, uh, a large office uh, out of Edmonton with Drew's Geological. Uh, we have another partner in uh, Ontario, another 10-person uh, uh, geological firm. Uh, some of my uh, most entertaining uh, uh, partners are, are from Newfoundland, and that's just because uh, I find it entertaining to speak to them. Um, well, you know what it's like. Uh, they make me laugh. Uh, and whenever you can laugh and do business, it's a good thing. We have, uh, we have uh, some partners in Australia, and I think you might see some Australian graphite action here, uh, because when Zim2 identified the graphite sector, it was very early on, and we were able to do very well in Australia. The key to uh, Zim2 is that uh, whenever we get involved in a company, we, we try and stick with it for the long term. Uh, we're looking to, uh, to enjoy some major liquidity event with the company uh, on their success. Our other um, um, business activity that isn't necessarily graphite is, is the private to public aspect and we're involved with a number of companies at the private stage that will become public over the next four months or over the next quarter and that will add substantially to the net present value of Zim2 Capital Corp. We're also involved uh, uh, with companies, uh, inactive companies and helping them uh, to move to a more active status and again that adds significant value to Zim2's bottom line. Ladies and gentlemen, you should be buying Zim2 partly because of what's coming and partly because what's already in the portfolio. We, uh, we have a good team and, uh, and generally can execute on our opportunities um, um, very successfully. One, uh, one more little story that's a little more fun. I told you that when the world needs a commodity, the world comes to Vancouver. If they need graphite, the world is looking at Vancouver to solve that problem. You people, the, the, the brokers, the investors, the company people, the world is saying we need more graphite. That opportunity is for you. And uh, one of the initiatives that uh, I have underway with uh, Cambridge House International um, is we bought the bull. And uh, <laughs> kind of a funny story. I, I bought this bull in, uh, in New York. And uh, I'm having the bulls shipped out to Vancouver. And I, I tell Joe Martin the story. He likes the story so much. He says, let me have part of that bull. I says, Joe, I'll sell you half the bull. <laughs> Of course, you know which half I sold them. <laughs> anyway, that's Joe Martin. He's not here to defend himself, although I did see his son here earlier. So, uh, um, in any event, uh, Zim2 Capital Corp and uh, Cambridge House International will move that bowl across the country from Calgary to Saskatoon, Montreal, Toronto. We will introduce that bowl, Vancouver's bowl, to the Canadian marketplace. And a year from now, we hope to have that bull on the street in Vancouver representing the fact that you people, you people have solved the global graphite problem because that's what Vancouver does. Vancouver does most of the exploration globally is financed from Vancouver. My name's Dave Hodge. I'm very glad I was here, but I'm more glad you were here. Hope to see you out on the convention floor. Thank you.